Hey guys, welcome back. So, Happy Skin has a new release. I think this is part of their skincare line and it's the Rescue Me Sun Gel Primer SPF 50 PA++++++. This is a sun gel primer that is tinted. So, yung mga claims nila are walang white cast, yung mga usual na problema pagdating sa mga sunscreen. So, ngayon, itatry natin yung lahat. I'll tell you more about these produ these, this product and we'll also try to put makeup above it kung maganda nga siya na primer for makeup, especially ngayon na medyo umiinit na, na it's summer na. Kaya perfect na perfect tong product na to if you're looking for a sunscreen to use pag nag-beach kayo, kung mag-beach man kayo. And, Kung gusto niyo lang i-protect yung skin niyo kasi it's getting really really hot and maaraw. Before anything else, please do subscribe, comment down below, like this video, it really helps me a lot and follow me on all my social media channels. So ngayon, let's go to my review of the Happy Skin Rescue Me Sun Gel Primer. So the Happy Skin Rescue Me Sun Gel Primer comes in this very simplistic, very minimalist na blue na packaging. Tapos when you open it, meron siyang spout. And then, doon siya lalabas yung product. Pag squeeze nyo ng product, may kita nyo na the cream or the sunscreen is tinted. Kaya siya tinted kasi ang sabi nila, this will prevent a white cast. So, yun yung itatry natin. Today, titignan natin kung talaga nga wala siyang white cast. And then, they also claim na it's very fast absorbent and meron siyang niacinamide, which is very, very good for our skin. Brightening siya. And ceramide, which keeps the skin healthy. Nagbasa ako sa box kasi baka mali yung masabi ko. They also claim na this product is very hydrating and has a glowy finish pero hindi siya oily so titignan natin if that's also true. Ngayon, tinignan ko yung collection ko for mga sunscreens. Meron akong tatlo na ginagamit ko on rotation depende on my mood. I have the Real Kill 99 which is my favorite one out of all of them kasi primer din to so I think this is the most comparable dito sa happy skin. And then this one, Filtering Cream from Duocell. This is also a primer slash skincare na product. So, very comparable din. And then, ito yung pinaka naiiba, which is a stick na SPF. Para siyang deodorant, pero SPF siya. Ito, hindi ko to masyadong gusto. Kasi, feeling ko, kahit na powdery finish yung product na to, I feel like nagiging greasy yung mukha ko. Kaya, hindi ko to masyadong ginagamit. So, ngayon, I just want to swatch this beside the Happy Skin Rescue Me Sun Gel Primer. Kasi, yung pinaka-problem ko dito sa dalawang to, especially dito sa Dewy Cell one, is meron talaga siyang white cast. Nagmumukhang grayish yung mukha ko. Kaya ngayon, I just want to put it dito sa likod ng arms ko. Tignan natin yung difference nilang tatlo. Okay, so nalalaglag siya. Woo! This is the Dewy Cell one. This is the Real Kill na primer. And then, this is the Sun Gel Primer from Happy Skin. So, kitang-kita naman yung difference. Yung Real Kill is very watery. Kaya, hirap na hirap ako ang kalat na niya. And then, this is the Dewy Cell. Ito, meron talaga yung gray cast. As in, ayan o. Oh, yan yung mahirap sa sunscreen eh. Kasi, sobrang puti nila. Nagre-reflect sila ng light. Kaya nagkaka-white cast, yun yung explanation doon. So, I feel like dahil tint, tinted, dahil tinted tong sun gel primer from Happy Skin, nakakatulong talaga siya pagdating sa white cast. The only problem is, isa lang yung shade niya. So, I feel like kung dark ka talaga, kung super morena mo, it won't work for you as much. Pero, it still helps as compared to other products like this. Like itong dalawa. Tignan nyo naman yan, pinaghalo ko na. Pero, tignan nyo yung difference, di ba? Ang puti. Tapos ito, it blends out very well. It's like it's absorbed. Tapos, tinitake niya yung color ng skin niyo. So, that's my initial comparison. So, now, I'll apply it on my skin. And then, i-voice over ko na lang yung mga thoughts ko sa kanya upon application. Hindi na ito yung first time na in-apply ko siya. So, I have a very good idea na kung ano yung thoughts ko sa product na to. I've used it for a whole day. So, meron na rin akong wear test sa kanya. Which I'll be doing at the end of the video. Okay, so upon applying the product, may kita natin yung tint niya works very well. Pero pagka-blend out ko na, 
doon na lumalabas yung pagka-sunscreen aspect niya. Meron siyang parang slight-slight white cast na binibigay. But, nung na-absorb naman na yung product ng skin ko, I feel like nawala yung white cast na to. And parang nagbe-blend out na lang siya into my skin tone, which I like very much. Yun nga lang, yun yung hindi ko sure. Paano kung mas darker ka sa akin? If mas morena ka, baka meron pa rin yung white cast na yun. Yun yung hindi ko lang sure, ha? so take note. Tapos, yung texture nitong product na to, I like it. Kasi unlike other sunscreens, hindi siya greasy at all. As in, parang mattifying pa nga siya, pero it still gives a very, very nice glow. And it works well under makeup. Meron siyang slight blurring effect. I feel like ganun yung effect na binibigay niya. I tried applying the Essie Co. Skin Tint on top of this and ang ganda na naging effect niya. Very natural lang, parang wala akong makeup but very very healthy. So, makikita nyo naman sa next part ng video na to when I'm talking more about the product, about my thoughts, kung anong itsura ng makeup on top of it. Yan. Like it. So, yun nga, as I've said kanina, ginamit ko na tong Sun Gel Primer for a whole day. My thoughts on it is it has a matte finish which is very very good kasi usually pagdating sa mga sunscreens very greasy yung feeling niya. Ito hindi. It parang feeling mo fresh ka pa rin pag suot mo siya. Hindi ka pinagpapawisan. Unless sobrang init talaga na hindi mo naman makokontrol mapawisan. Pero yun, I like the finish of this one and I like na hindi siya nagbibigay ng white cast as much as these other products. Ito namang real kill, hindi masyadong malala yung white cast niya, pero it has a very very slight one. If you are looking for SPF ngayon, lalo na na sobrang umiinit na, I suggest na you check out this one. It's a little bit more expensive than the real kill, pero I feel like you get better quality also kasi meron siyang mga ingredients which will help your skin look better talaga. And it doubles as a very very good primer kasi it has a blurring effect. Yun pala, I forgot to mention that, na napansin ko yun kahapon, na meron siyang blurring effect, almost parang pinowder yung mukha mo. Pero hindi ka mukhang cakey. Don't get me wrong, hindi siya mukhang cakey. Pero mukha kang may blur, mukha kang may filter, ganun. So I like that one. And yun, wala na akong masabi sa kanya kasi basta, Mabilis talaga bang intindihin yun na basta if you need an SPF, this is a very very good choice to get. And I think it's priced very well for the for the things that you're getting. So it's non-greasy, it's fast absorbent, it does its job of protecting your skin, and it's very well priced in my opinion. Kahit medyo mahal. You get what you pay for. Yan. So those are my thoughts on this New release also from Happy Skin. Yeah. So, I'll end this video. And if you found value in my content, if na-enjoy nyo tong review na to, please don't forget to subscribe. Like this video kasi tinutulungan ako doon sobra. As in, it boosts up my video and helps my channel a lot. Kaya, like this video. Comment na rin kayo sa baba if you have any request. Kung may mga products kayo na gusto nyong i-review ko. And if may gusto lang kayo sabihin, go ahead. And yun! Follow me on all my social media channels and I'll see you on my next video. Bye!